Hey guys, what's up? You're watching Brett's iOS Help, and uh, before we get started with this video, I just really wanted to say that I am sorry for not posting a video on this channel uh, for actually, I think it's like over a month now, or even close to a month. Uh, basically, I'm not going to lie to you, I have been very busy recently. Uh, that's been keeping me from making all these YouTube videos that I've been really actually wanting to post on YouTube. Uh, like a lot of these Cydia tweaks, and even, heck, I even missed the jailbreak for the 4S, that video, uh, mainly because it was exam week, and I was having to study hard, and uh, just really had no time, plus I also had work. Uh, so uh, that was basically why I wasn't able to post videos for, yeah, that period of time. But anyways, I really hope to get back into making videos for you guys and producing more content. Uh, to be honest, I've been kind of missing it. But anyways... Let's move on to the yeah. Let's move on with this video. Uh, so today we got a actually I believe it came out just a while ago. It's called Hands Free Control, and it is a Siri tweak uh, that basically allows you to call up Siri from uh, not even having to touch the device. Uh, so let's hope that it works because I've had this actually fail on me a few times before. Uh, it's not perfect, but uh, let's give it a try. So here we go, Siri. And uh, would you look at that? I didn't even touch the device, and uh, see, there's nobody touching the device. I'll try to position it like that. There's no shenanigans going on. Here's my hands, right here. Siri. There we go. Okay, that was kind of quick. I don't know what was going on with that. Siri. Okay, come on, baby. Siri. Siri. There we go. Uh, so you can see it's kind of fidgety, but uh, you can see that it works. Um, there are some issues with it, like uh, working or trying to get it to work in like a crowded place with a lot of people. Um, it it doesn't really work too well. Like if you're at school or okay, don't come up with me now. Uh, <laughs> Uh, if you're trying to get it to work in like a public place or somewhere loud, it uh, will have some troubles picking it up. It also, there's some bugs, like if you say something close to the keyword Siri, uh, hopefully it doesn't bother right now, okay, good. <laughs> Uh, if you say something close to Siri, it probably will um, pick it up. What it does is it's constantly listening in the background at a low voltage or a low power consumption state. Uh, so you don't really see too much of a battery drain, at least I haven't. Uh, nothing noticeable, at least maybe if you're like tracking it, some shenanigans like that. Uh, then you'll probably notice it, but it, it doesn't, it barely uses any battery, which is pretty cool. So uh, basically, let's go into settings that show you some of the uh, cool things you got here. Uh, so you just find it right here is a little pink icon, hands-free control. Uh, you can turn on and off the service, so if you don't want it to uh, pop up, if you're like in a meeting or, I don't know, school, something like that, you don't want it popping up, you can just flip that off, and uh, that's pretty cool. You can also do the sensitivity, so you can have it be very strict, so you have to like perfectly say the word, or you can have it very loose, but uh, if you do loose, then it'll, anything that's close to Siri, it'll pick up, and then it'll activate it. Oops. Let's go back to normal. Uh, you have keywords, and this is pretty cool. You can have it set to Siri, or you can have a computer, or all these other ones. You can even do custom, which is pretty cool. You can type in the keyword, and if you say that keyword, it will pop up. So that's pretty cool. Uh, you have voice response. Um, basically, actually, I really don't know what that is. Uh, maybe someone in the comments could uh, give me a little help there. Uh, but anyways, moving on, we have audio quality. Uh, basically. Uh, what it does is if you're playing music, you can adjust the quality here uh, so it's lower. I really don't know why they do this. must be some some reason. Uh, and then you have uh, how to use and basically credits. How to use, just basically a guide, all that other stuff. Credits, the guy that made it. Uh, and uh, I don't know why they have the crack me thing, but apparently says I have a licensed copy, which is good because I did buy this thing. So anyways... That is pretty much it. The tweak is uh, $2.99, I believe. Let's go over here into that. Yeah, $2.99, and uh, you can find it in the Big Boss repo. It is a default repo, so you don't have to add anything. So uh, that's pretty cool. Hands-free control, and uh, you can go find it in Cydia for your jailbroken iPhone 4S or even some iPad 2s that have Siri ported over to it. Anyways, hope you guys have a great day, and um, hope you look forward to a lot of my videos that I hope to be posting in the near future. Hopefully not going to be a whole month span or anything like that. But anyways, guys, I bid you a fair evening or morning or wherever you are in this time of the world. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just going to go, so uh, peace.